Hey guys, look at the llamas. They are growing up beautifully. The llama beans. Now, something that I learned last night, like I said, I do a lot of research. I like to watch a lot of videos um, because the people that do the videos that have been doing these for a long time, they not really know what to do. So, I've been watching a lot of videos and I did not know the small llama beans are the butter beans, all right? And the big llama beans are the regular llama beans. So, the green llama beans are butter beans when they are green and when they turn white they're just llama beans okay so yeah i'm excited guys look at beauty look at that beauty uh, 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 do i see a i already see a flower coming up in there i didn't even notice that guys look at that flower that is a flower that's a flower i didn't even see that flower coming up out of there i'm like so so excited guys Look at that flower. I'm about to get me some food. Then I have some more llama beans growing there. I'm just excited, guys. I'm just excited. And I want you guys to get excited about growing your food because this is the way it might be from now on that we might have to grow our own food. This might be the new normal. So, hey, check it out. I'm excited. Yes. Good morning, guys. So I'm just coming down here so I can uh, water my food this morning in the greenhouse. And I come in, and we see our potatoes are growing. Yes, yeah, so I have white potatoes in here, and they are growing. I'm so excited. I just put these down about a couple days ago, and look at the shoots already coming up. So good, so good. Potatoes, white potatoes. So excited. You see more there, there, there. I'm excited, guys. Excited, excited, excited. Look at this, baby. Look at that llama bean. It just sprouted out out of nowhere. Look at that. And the other two are coming up on the side there. Let's see if we can get you inside there. All right. Now, this is the way lima beans are supposed to grow, guys. Look how nice and healthy this stock is. Nice and healthy. That's a beautiful llama bean. Um, and in the back, don't forget, look how beautiful my lime, uh, my sugar snap peas are growing nicely. Good, good. They're growing beautiful, so yeah. My sugar snap peas are growing nicely. All right? And I'm just loving the fact that my llama beans are coming up. I think I planted four, but only these three are coming up so far. But this baby is gorgeous. Excited, 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 guys. So, yeah. If you just believe, trust in yourself, have patience, you can also grow food. So, let's get growing, guys. All right, good morning, guys. So, I'm coming down and I'm just checking the food that I have in my windowsill growing. So, yes, you can grow food in your windowsill also, guys. All right. So, we're all about in growing indoors. All right. So I do have a few plants also in here, but just have some food and I wanted to show you guys. So you can replant lettuce, regrow lettuce, as you guys can see on the side here, that's a new growth there. Here, that's a new growth. And down there, that's a new growth. Um, as you can see on top, that's a new growth peeking out of there. That's just new growth coming out of every which way in this, um, for this lettuce this right here is just the uh, uh, uh lemon tree that i uh, planted and i just put it in some water um but yes this is my lettuce guys look at that look, look at those new shoots coming out all right that is lettuce all right so you can regrow lettuce all right all right that's one of my rules trees i pulled out from outside now i do have this leaf here um, my boyfriend seems to think it's a mahogany leaf, but I'm going to look this up and see if that is a mahogany leaf. But I put it in here so we can root it and see what's going to happen with it. And I think it does have roots on it already. Let's see. Yep. She has roots. So we're going to plant her after I find out what she is. Okay. All right. And then there's another little lemon plant that I put in there. And this is supposed to be a piece of a rose from out of my rose bush garden, as you guys can see through the window. Um, but I don't know. Do have a couple of nodes in there, so hopefully some roots will grow from out of there. But 
I'm not sure, but we'll see. We'll see how that goes. All right. And this is my beautiful, beautiful broccoli. Look how the leaves are growing up. Let me move this out of the way so it doesn't distract you for what I'm trying to show you. All right. Look at those. Look at those roots in there. Beautiful, gorgeous roots in there, right? This is my broccoli. You can regrow broccoli, guys. So don't forget, you can regrow grow broccoli also. So what you want to do is after you finish using up the broccoli, throw the, the stalk back in some water. As you guys can see, there's some roots there and some leaves. So I'm excited, guys. I don't know about you guys, but I'm excited. So yes. All right. And then in here, just have some uh, cuttings. Well, not even cuttings. They just fall, they uh, came apart when I was pulling them out. The, uh, these are the uh, pothos, golden pothos. And they are growing good so far. Now, I've been having these things. I'm cleaning the water out of all of this. Every three days, I clean the water, okay? You change the water. Um, so, there's one there. Gorgeous. If anyone wants one, just let me know, and I will send them one. I have three available, okay? And these are growing beautiful. You just got to stick them in some water, let them root out some more. Or you could just throw them in the dirt because these are dirt catchers. They love to grow in dirt. Even Although they will grow in water, as you guys can see, they are growing in water. I'm trying to find you one that has a root on it already. There we go. See that? That's a root. So that, that's gorgeous. So I've been growing these in water for a couple weeks now. All right. So, and there's nothing wrong when they fall in here. They still don't get messed up or anything like that. So, I just let them fall in there. They don't do anything but grow. So, if anybody wants one of these, just let me know and I'll send it to you in the mail. And then I'm trying to regrow part of this fig. This is a big uh, leaf here. All right. So, this one came off. So I'm trying to root it. I'm not, oh, I'm not sure if that one's going to root or not, but it's been staying in water for the last couple weeks. And it's been going just fine, all right? So hold on for one moment, guys. <coughs> now, guys, now we're here in my other window. And I just have golden pothos in here uh, growing. And I do have another fig growing, fig leaf growing. And this is beautiful. I got to show you guys the roots on that. And then I have some more golden pothos and another got golden pothos. If anyone wants these, let me know and I will send them to you. So you have to let me know, okay? And I will send you those golden pothos, all right? Now this I'm excited for. This is uh, one of the fig leaves. But look at all this pink on here. Absorb too much water as a baby. So that's how you get all this, these uh, spots like that. Absorb too, not too much water as a baby, but absorb the water too quickly when it was growing, so that's what it looks like. It's an absolutely beautiful, beautiful leaf. Okay, just look at the fine details on these leaves here. You see how gorgeous these thick leaves are? It has its own DNA. Just look, look at it, like a fingerprint. It's gorgeous. Every inch of this leaf is totally different, and I love the pattern on here all right so what i wanted to show you guys was this i could not believe it when i seen it myself look at what we have guys we have roots coming out i'm so excited look at that uh, i'm so excited guys all these roots are coming out and i'm just excited for that one so yeah really excited for that one but just the detail in this plants it's just amazing gorgeous you definitely can tell this took a lot of work to grow absolutely beautiful all right guys so don't forget guys if you want one of these you gotta let me know in the comments and i will give you the one of those okay i only have two of those and also like the ones in the kitchen that i showed you i can give three of those away believe me these plants grow quickly and they survive a long time as long as you water them Water them, give them a little bit of sun, and they're fine, okay? 
Golden pot, those are one of the easiest plants to grow. They they just vine all over the place, all right? So if you guys want any of those or the ones in the kitchen, the baby ones, just let me know. In the comments, let's get growing, guys.